I'm Eileen Rivera, and this is Bixby Knowles TV. My team and I are committed to introducing you to the people, the businesses, and the homes of Bixby Knowles and the surrounding area. I hope that you enjoyed today's episode, and I look forward to seeing you in the neighborhood. Hi, my name is Jose with the Rivera Group. I have the pleasure today of interviewing the owner of Lola's Mexican Cuisine. Can you tell me a little bit about the, the story or history of Lola's? Yeah, of course. Um, so Lola's uh, Mexican Cuisine uh, opened in 2008. It was my mother's dream. What is the restaurant? So it was kind of like a family affair and we kind of all rallied to open up with her. First restaurant was on 4th Street. We recently just opened up our second restaurant here in Bixby Knolls. And that's kind of uh, how everything got started. Now I see that you opened this restaurant not that long ago. What uh, inspired you to open the second restaurant from the main restaurant on 4th Street? We get a lot of phone calls and a lot of requests of, you know, hey, I got this location. And, you know, we'd looked and we'd been actually being pulled by the city of LA for a long time. We went out to LA, this is about four or five years ago. We looked around and we just never found that right location. The whole time that this is going on, we're trying to figure out where we're gonna go. Uh, Blair, Blair Cohn, I call him the godfather up here in Bixby Knowles. And the whole time he kind of kept a pulse on us. You know, he'd send an occasional email, give us an occasional phone call. Hey, we're still here. Hey, this is going on. We got word that this location where we are, uh, 4140 Atlantic Avenue was gonna become available. I looked at it and this was the one that spoke to me. Right. This was the one that was like, okay, like we can do this, this feels right. And I could feel it in my heart. And, uh, and yeah, and we just chose to move forward with it. In, in terms of your restaurant, is there anything, a special dish that is favorite of yours? For me personally, I like to stick with the traditional dishes. And the two dishes would be the chile relleno, and the reason for that is uh, it was my mom's favorite. I mean, she ate that one like pretty much every day. And then there's one that is uh, our birria, you know, and that's um, a dish that really represents uh, where my family roots are from, which is Guadalajara. Now I see you have a large selection of alcohol here. Is there any special drink that you guys are known for, or is there a special drink that you like, or a special drink that uh, you recommend? There's actually three cocktails that are my personal favorites. One would be the telenovela. Um, it's made with our house-infused pineapple tequila. Uh, that one's extremely delicious. Oaxacan margarita, which instead of tequila, we're using uh, Montelobo's mezcal. And third, this is actually my, my favorite favorite, is the mole groni. So it's like our take on a negroni. Wonderful, that sounds delicious. Definitely we're gonna try one of those. Luis, thank you very much for letting us uh, interview you today. And uh, you know, please come by and visit Lola's. It's a great restaurant. <laughs>